Hey guys, welcome to Quinian's. Yeah, who am I kidding? You guys, you guys know who you're watching. You're all adults. If you follow me on Facebook or Twitter or I don't know where else I'm gonna post to Patreon, uh, you probably already saw the thing that I put out. I need to amend that just a little bit. But uh, if you haven't seen that, the thing is, I spent the past week reading everything the FTC's put out, everything YouTube put out. I watched all their videos. I watched everything. It, it doesn't matter. Uh, so, I mean, unless you're a lawyer or an FTC employee, I, I don't want to argue the finer points of it with you. I'm not saying that I know more than you. What I am saying is that none of us know anything, and that's the problem. The FTC's rules are vague. They're intentionally vague, and they are so vague that even YouTube is like, hey, we don't know. Go hire a lawyer. So, with that going on, what I'm going to do, because according to their little things of what, what like child attractive, whatever the hell, uh, their thing makes most of my videos fall into their prohibited category. And before you start ending me on, you know, monetized ad, whatever, stop. It's, it has nothing to do with that. It's, somebody said that once, and it got freaking picked up and ran with. If you read the FTC's whole thing, they don't care about your ads. All they give a shit about is the the data collection. And if you upload anything to YouTube, that's data collection. That's where analytics come from. That's why YouTube wants people even non-monetized people, to check the little box that says if you have uh, um, four kids or not. So, the thing is, I still have all my videos, the, the original video file, the Blender save file, all that stuff. I've got every single one of them. I can edit those down and make them fit within the rules once I know what the rules are. But until then, I'm not quitting. I'm just going to change the format of my videos a little bit. Like, you've probably seen... Mm, assorted rivet sizes or um, I've talked about my vice and stuff like that a few times Those are tools that I use after I've shown you the hard way to do it and the cheap way to do it That I turn the camera off and I go use those because it makes life a lot easier They don't really fit into the budget thing, but no tools really do So I probably do like a tool review or something like that uh, The salt marsh house. I'm still doing that. That thing is giving me fits uh, That'll probably be the next video though because I'll show you where I'm at with that and that will also be another slight change to the channel. If it's smaller things like um, scatter and stuff like that, yeah, obviously I can do that for pennies. If it's a you know a two-story house, three-story if you count the attic house, you can't really be cheap. I mean, you can, well, you can be cheap or you can have it good. You, you can't have it both ways. So I'll show you what happened trying to do it cheap, and I'll tell you how I should have done it the slightly more expensive way. But that that's the next video. For now, I just want to say... That I'm not quitting and also the FTC has heard the outrage from creators they've heard the outrage from tech guys and lawyers and all those people deserve their own video on what they're saying and why they're right and stuff the point is that the FTC realized that they screwed up and they're really looking into their stuff and they're gonna make it more black and white as to what exactly is and isn't allowed which is great so I will keep reading all the crap they put out until my eyes start to bleed and then once that's sorted out, I'll return to your regularly scheduled programming. Until then, I'm going to make sure that I don't have any toys or any bright colors or any cartoons or any, any of that. My old videos, I'm going to put them as unlisted. They still exist. They're going to be marked not made for kids, but unlisted just to be safe. And then future videos may or may not have that. I don't know. It depends on where the rules settle. But for right now, that's what we're going with. I can still do builds, I just have to be careful about what exactly I'm building and what my source material is. As far as putting out videos on a regular update, I actually do want to enjoy the holidays with the family, so, I mean, I want to take a break. I suggest you guys, you know, get off YouTube, go hang out with your family. But I am still making things, like this monstrosity here behind me, and I'm recording every bit of it, so, you know, this is where this camera normally sits right here. So I will have a backlog of videos to show once the dust has settled so i'm not quitting don't go anywhere uh salt marsh house will probably be next or the update on it will be next and then maybe a tool review and i might take a break at that point to go and you know get fat or er, fatter yeah all right later guys